I'm burning up in this sweater. New sweater alert. <laughs> Got it from Gordman's. Super cute, super comfy, kind of loose. It makes me feel a little bit better. However, my bloat's today not as big as I thought it was gonna be, which is awesome. Um, it seems like that always happens. I always overthink that I'm gonna be super bloated the next day and then I'm not. Being in the process of getting rid of like a bunch of crap food and stuff in my house, <laughs> I think when we come back from vacation, we'll be in a much better and healthier mindset. Um, I don't plan on buying any more cookie butter for a while. I don't plan on getting any candy or anything, which I know there's a balance and stuff like that, but I don't want to have it in the house when it's always there. It's gone, then we can't eat it. And it's like, if we really want it, we'd have to go get it. And that's an effort. I don't think either one of us are going to have to make or want to make, in other words. Today's Monday. It's fasting day, so I gotta go fill up the water bottle. Gotta go drink the coffee because I feel like I'm dead. Right here at 5:30 this morning to get started, um, since I am leaving work early on Wednesday. So I got a lot to do, a lot to get caught up on and stay caught up on the next couple of days. So that way, like I said, I can leave early. I'm gonna try to be in a better mindset today, since yesterday was so emotionally rough for me, just because I didn't like the way I looked or felt or anything, and I hate days like that but they happen and I would rather be 100% honest with you guys than fake it and let you think that everything's fine and dandy and I don't feel like I'm failing and things like that. Um, it's just good to see both sides of the coin, I guess, so that way you know that everybody goes through the same thing as well. I think I'm more frustrated with myself is because I wanted to feel good about my body when we went on the cruise and I had planned on being really good this November up until it, and it's just not happened. Um, but that's life and I can't say that I haven't enjoyed what I have done because I have but it's afterwards when I start overthinking everything that I've ate or whatever that um, really sets me off and puts me in a weird mood but anyway I'm gonna let you guys go so I can go to work I'll talk to you guys later on this afternoon I have 10 hours until my vacation starts because I was able to take off tomorrow. So uh, yeah, it's starting earlier and I'm so excited about it. I know you guys are tired of hearing about it, but uh, I'm, I'm living, just waiting for it basically. Get to see my brother, get to see some new places and go someplace I've never thought I would be able to go for. So it's gonna be good. Today's an day, guys. I'm excited about that too. <laughs> for breakfast I'm gonna do oatmeal with some cinnamon and swerve brown sugar and a banana and then for lunch I'm doing some chicken salad wraps with lettuce tomato onion and some snap peas probably for like a side or whatever and then for dinner tonight I'm making these burgers that I picked up at Target last week they're made with protein so like pea protein and beef. I'll have to show them to you guys later because I can't remember exactly what brand they are, what they look like or anything. I just know when I was there last week getting beef for my um, stuffed burgers, I saw those two and picked them up and we have buns at home that need to be eaten and food's gonna be great today. I can feel it. Hopefully I don't overeat or overindulge though. It's my biggest problem. It seems like anymore but I feel okay right now. I don't feel too hungry. Last night I did but feel better now. I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go and I will talk to you later on this afternoon whenever my vacation started. <laughs> okay. I am so excited right now because it's nice enough to run outside. It's like 64 degrees or something so um, I'm gonna go do that thing because obviously I don't want to run on the treadmill. Oh uh, let's see how the day went. I didn't break my fast until 10, which is, you know, where I try to break it out usually. And I had a bowl of oatmeal with a banana. And then for lunch, I had star kissed chicken salad packets with lettuce, tomato, onion, and all my tortillas with some sugar snap peas. So I was really full after lunch. Um, I didn't snack or anything actually all day. So that's good. <laughs> I did end up having the cauliflower Cheez-Its 
in my drawer at work before I left because I could feel myself getting a little snacky and didn't want to eat too much. But uh, now I'm home, I'm gonna go run, and I've already added in all my calories for dinner, and I am under still, so that's good. After I run, I know I'll have more calories that I could eat if I wanted to, so that's all good stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna let you guys go. I wanna go do it before the sun goes down completely, and I will talk to you guys later on. It is 6.37 on Wednesday morning and I am getting ready to sew my formal dress for our cruise because I didn't have time to do that last night. We got pretty busy and I just I didn't have time. I was so busy last night after I came home. Uh, came home and I ran. I did my 3.1 mile run around the neighborhood, which was awesome. I was so grateful that I was able to get that done and out of the way. I've been wanting to run outside for a while again, but it's just not been nice enough. And yesterday I had gotten up to 64 or something like that. So I was able to go outside and run and it was awesome. <laughs> and then I came home and showered, of course, and made dinner. Um, we had those pea protein Angus beef burgers. It has beef and protein in them with some of my cheesy cauliflower tots that I made as well. And then we were just busy the rest of the night doing everything that we had to do to get prepared for our cruise. And I went to bed around 10.30ish, I think. I was actually really surprised with myself because I thought I was gonna be a lot hungrier yesterday than I was, and I was not. So I actually was left with like 54 calories or something for the rest of the day um, last night. I've been going back and forth on being able to eat today and not. Right now I'm completely fine. I won't need to eat, I don't think, for a while if I do want to eat. Maybe I'll hold off and just do like one meal a day or get lunch with my mom for her birthday or something like that. But Right now I'm kind of wanting to fast and see how it goes for me. If anything, maybe I'll do like a 16, eight fast or whatever to start off my vacation. But you know me, if I can get a longer fast in, I'll feel better about it, <laughs> but I don't know. Like I said though, right now I'm in the process of getting ready to sew my formal. I want to get this done and out of the way. It'll kind of wake me up a little bit too before I decide to go downstairs and do a lower body workout today. This will probably be the last lower body workout I'll be doing before we go on our trip. I'm not really sure what the exercise is going to be like um, on the boat. I know that my brother can get us into their crew gym if needed. I know that they also have a gym there as well, but I don't really know what that means for lifting. I know they have cardio and things like that, but um, we'll be doing a lot of walking and stuff, so I'm not really sure how much cardio I'll want to do or any exercise for that matter once we're there. Bowser says good morning. <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys go though so I can get this formal dress sewn and out of the way so that way I can start the rest of my day and I will talk to you guys later on this afternoon. I just stepped out on my porch to do a little bit of vlogging and I got dropped on by rain. So maybe it's getting ready to rain. It does look kind of cloudy, so there's that. But anyway, what's up guys? Um, let's see, today I got up, I went and I worked out in the basement and it was a lower body workout, which was a good one. Um, I basically pushed myself pretty decently hard knowing that I probably wouldn't really be working out again for a while the way that I want to. And then I got dressed and went up to my mom's and decided to go ahead and break and do a 16-8 fast today, or maybe even one meal a day. I don't know, I'm not very hungry right now, but I ended up getting a shrimp po' boy with my mom and fries. And I brought her a pie, one of her favorites. And I just talked to her a little bit before we went on our trip tonight. So I guess you could say I'm starting off this vacation with letting loose or trying to. It's still really hard for me to do so, but I'm working on it and it's gonna take some time and I'm hoping I can just relax. That's the goal anyway. I do wanna go ahead and sign out of this week's vlog though because it's Wednesday and I wanna start my new vlog um, tomorrow because I know we're gonna be really stressed out trying to get to the airport and stuff tonight. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this one here and um, we'll see how this next week in the Bahamas goes. Thank you so much guys for stopping by and watching this week's kind of short vlog. I really appreciate it and I will catch you guys on the next.